lately there's been a lot of discussions about love and it's, it's been good because I've been able to look in this and see that so many other people are so wrong about love. I mean, it's just so crystal clear what love is and how it is. Any other day, I, th I thought about how God says that I'm a son of His. And to think, to think that I, as a son of God, am trying to explain to, to lungs of, of clay that how love really is. Think about that. Just to think that we think the lumps of clay are experts on love and on how love moves. We, we can't be careless in this discussion. We can't just lay out all the facts on the table and just think, oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. You, you understand all the facts that are in this book and maybe you, you will come to the right conclusions. No, no, we can't do that. You think maybe, maybe you'll figure this out. No. But maybe the thing I'm, I'm most concerned about is arrogance. I mean, we can't just put our, our thoughts and our meanings above, above God's actions. And it's just wrong to do. I mean, when I read through this book, I mean, man, all through this book, there's some things that I, I wouldn't think to do. Like in Matthew 9, when, when the woman just touches the, the cloak of Jesus, he heals her. I mean, I wouldn't think to do that. I would have just been mad because my, my clothes were dirty. And, and there's other passages that are just even more unsettling to my stomach, like like Jonah. God doesn't completely destroy the Assyrians just because the Assyrians ask for forgiveness. And I think, wow, God, did, did you just do that? And then I think of the cross. I think, really, God? You let your son die for dirty, filthy sinners? I think I would have never thought to do that. We think about love in this book. It's not that. It's evident that love doesn't doesn't fail. It, it doesn't it doesn't falter. And we expound upon it with our reasoning and our thoughts and our understandings of love. We can figure out that that, that love doesn't lose. Love does more than just to win. It does the greater. It dominates the character of God with this crazy love that we just can't comprehend. We just can't comprehend it. And it's important for us to understand that love dominates this and it dominates the character of God. 